Welcome to the channel, dear viewers. Today we venture into the emerald depths of the Amazon rainforest, a realm teeming with life in its most diverse and indeed most dangerous forms. Prepare to be amazed by the intricate adaptations and deadly venoms of these fascinating creatures. From the wandering menace of the Brazilian wandering spider to the formidable size of the Goliath bird eater. We'll journey deep into the heart of the jungle, uncovering the secrets of their hunting strategies, their venomous defenses, and their remarkable lives in this unforgiving ecosystem. Join me, if you dare, as we embark on this thrilling expedition into the world of the Amazon's most venomous spiders. Our journey begins with a creature whose very name strikes fear into the hearts of locals, the Brazilian wandering spider. This is no docile denizen of the forest floor. It's an active hunter, often found prowling through the undergrowth or more ominously seeking shelter in human dwellings. Its scientific name, Phonutria, translates to murderous, a testament to its potent venom. Unlike many spiders that rely on webs to ensnare their prey, the Brazilian wandering spider actively hunts, injecting a potent cocktail of neurotoxins with its large, powerful fangs. These fangs are not just a weapon, they're a tool for survival, capable of piercing the tough exoskeletons of insects and delivering a paralyzing dose of venom. But make no mistake, a bite from this spider can be a serious medical emergency. The venom affects the nervous system, causing severe pain, muscle paralysis, and in some cases, even death. The Brazilian wandering spider is a true marvel of evolution, a testament to the power of natural selection in the heart of the Amazon. Our next encounter brings us face to face with a creature often misunderstood, feared for its imposing size and shrouded in myth, the Amazonian brown tarantula. This is a spider of considerable size, its leg span reaching up to eight inches and its body covered in fine velvety hairs. Despite its fearsome appearance, the Amazonian brown tarantula is not inherently aggressive. It's a solitary creature, preferring to spend its days hidden in its burrow, emerging at night to ambush unsuspecting prey. While not as potent as the Brazilian wandering spiders, its venom should not be underestimated. A bite from this tarantula can cause localized pain, muscle cramps, and in some cases, even systemic effects such as fever and nausea. The Amazonian brown tarantula plays a crucial role in the ecosystem, keeping populations of insects and other invertebrates in check. So while its size and appearance may inspire fear, the Amazonian brown tarantula is a creature deserving of our respect, a testament to the diversity and wonder of the Amazonian rainforest. Our journey into the heart of the Amazon now brings us to a true giant of the spider world, the Goliath bird eater. A creature whose very name evokes images of monstrous proportions. And indeed, this spider lives up to its name, boasting a leg span that can reach up to a foot in diameter, making it the largest spider on Earth. Despite its intimidating size and fearsome reputation, the Goliath bird eater is not a threat to humans. Its venom, while painful, is not considered medically significant to us. Birds, however, are another story. This spider's diet consists primarily of insects, but it's also known to prey on small vertebrates, including frogs, lizards, and yes, even birds. The Goliath bird eater hunts by ambush, lying in wait for unsuspecting prey to wander too close to its hidden burrow. Despite its size and predatory prowess, the Goliath bird eater plays a vital role in the delicate balance of the Amazonian ecosystem. We turn our attention now to a spider whose reputation for danger precedes it. The redback spider, a close relative of the infamous black widow and a denizen of not only the Amazon but also other parts of the world. Don't let its small size fool you. This spider packs a punch far exceeding its weight. The female, easily recognizable with her black body and distinctive red stripe, is the more venomous of the two sexes. Her venom, a complex cocktail of neurotoxins, is designed to target the nervous systems of her prey, typically insects and small invertebrates. While fatalities from redback spider bites are rare, thanks to the development of antivenom, the venom can cause severe pain, muscle spasms, and sweating in humans. The pain can be excruciating, radiating from the bite site and lasting for several hours or even days. The redback spider is a master of stealth, spinning messy, irregular webs in hidden corners and crevices. 
Though a creature of seemingly fearsome reputation, the red-backed spider plays a crucial role in controlling insect populations, a testament to the interconnectedness of life in the Amazon. Our exploration of the Amazon's venomous spiders brings us face to face with a creature whose very name evokes fear and fascination, the Black Widow, a spider as infamous as it is intriguing. Its jet black body, marked with the telltale red hourglass on the underside, serves as a warning, a symbol of danger recognized across the globe. The Black Widow's venom, a potent cocktail of neurotoxins, is indeed dangerous, capable of causing severe pain, muscle cramps, and even breathing difficulties in humans. However, fatalities are rare, particularly with prompt medical attention. Despite its deadly arsenal, the Black Widow is a shy creature, preferring to avoid confrontation and only biting in self-defense. Females, larger than males, are the architects of the Black Widow's messy, irregular webs, spun in dark, secluded corners. These webs, far from being delicate works of art, are sturdy traps designed to ensnare unsuspecting insects and even small vertebrates. The Black Widow, a creature of darkness and mystery, reminds us that even in the most familiar creatures, a hidden world of complexity and wonder awaits discovery. Our quest to uncover the secrets of the Amazon's spider diversity now leads us to a creature whose size and speed are as impressive as its hunting prowess, the Huntsman Spider. These giants among arachnids with their flattened bodies and long legs that can span up to six inches are a sight to behold. Unlike many of their web-spinning counterparts, Huntsman Spiders are active hunters, relying on their incredible speed and agility to pursue and overpower their prey. They are often found lurking beneath loose bark, in crevices, and even inside homes, their cryptic coloration providing excellent camouflage. While not considered deadly to humans, a bite from a huntsman spider can be a painful experience. Their primary instinct is to flee, their remarkable speed allowing them to vanish in the blink of an eye. The huntsman spider, a true marvel of adaptation, and a testament to the diversity of the spider world plays a crucial role in maintaining the delicate balance of the Amazonian ecosystem. We continue our exploration into the realm of the Amazon's eight-legged inhabitants with a creature known for its solitary nature and remarkable hunting skills, the wolf spider. Named for their wolf-like habit of chasing down prey, these spiders are solitary hunters, relying on their keen eyesight and lightning-fast reflexes to survive. Unlike many of their web-spinning relatives, wolf spiders are wanderers, preferring to stalk their prey across the forest floor rather than lie in wait. Their bodies, often covered in hair-like structures that aid in sensory perception, are perfectly adapted for a life on the move. While not considered deadly to humans, a bite from a wolf spider can be a painful experience. However, these spiders are not aggressive and will only bite if they feel threatened. The wolf spider, a testament to the power of adaptation and the diversity of the spider world, plays a vital role in the delicate balance of the Amazonian ecosystem, keeping populations of insects and other invertebrates in check. Our journey through the fascinating world of the Amazon spiders concludes with a creature known for its remarkable camouflage and patient hunting strategy, the crab spider. These masters of disguise, named for their crab-like appearance and sideways walk, are a testament to the power of adaptation in the animal kingdom. Unlike many of their web-spinning relatives, crab spiders are ambush predators, relying on their incredible camouflage and patience to secure their next meal. They can change their color to match their surroundings, blending seamlessly into flowers, leaves or bark. Their venom, while not considered dangerous to humans, is highly effective at subduing their prey, typically insects and other small invertebrates. A bite from a crab spider can cause localized pain and swelling in humans, but these spiders are not aggressive and rarely bite unless provoked. They lie in wait, often for hours, perfectly still, until an unsuspecting insect wanders within range. The crab spider, a master of disguise and a patient hunter, reminds us that even in the most unexpected of places, beauty and danger can coexist, a testament to the wonders that await discovery in the natural world. As our journey through the heart of the Amazon draws to a close, 
we're reminded of the incredible diversity and wonder that thrives within this emerald realm. From the giant Goliath bird eater to the stealthy crab spider, these eight-legged inhabitants showcase the power of adaptation, the beauty of nature's design, and the importance of respecting all creatures, no matter how venomous they may be. We've witnessed their hunting strategies, marveled at their venomous defenses, and gained a deeper understanding of their vital roles in the intricate web of life that sustains the Amazon rainforest. And thank you for joining me on this adventure. Until next time, keep exploring.